for your little ones, Macy's has the festive fashions that'll have them saying, It's too high! It's Are you ready to find out? I'm nervous. Don't be. Everything's gonna be fine. Deciding to have a baby wasn't a simple decision. So we didn't want a pregnancy test that just gave us a simple yes or a no. We wanted more information. And when it comes to giving information, there's only one name we trust to give it to us constantly. That's why we use the new CNN Take Home Pregnancy Test. Its relentless breaking alerts let us know that it's working hard to find out if we're having a baby. Breaking. Search for pregnancy underway. As CNN slowly analyzes my urine, it updates me on its breaking news screen. Breaking. Search for pregnancy continues. Because CNN believes we deserve all the information they can find. Breaking. CNN more confident than ever that it will soon know if you're pregnant. Okay. Even if that information is no information. Breaking. Search for pregnancy enters third week. Why is this taking so long? It's 2014. Honey, it's not the stick's fault. It's telling you everything it knows. I know. I'm not mad at the stick. It's just, this was fun at first, but now it's like, wait and tell me when you know. With breaking alerts every 10 minutes. Breaking. Six million U.S. women get pregnant each year. So? Daytime. Breaking. And nighttime. Oh, my God. We're having a baby. Nope. Oscar Pistorius took his legs off in court. He was really guilty. No. It was just about the legs. And when CNN finally does make a discovery about our pregnancy... Pregnancy foul! Yes! Oh I know it'll be accurate. Oh. Breaking. Cannot confirm pregnancy. Fifteen percent of the time. Great. Great. Cool. Awesome. Really great! Fine. The CNN take-home pregnancy test. For when you want to know that they don't know. Honey, I guess I was pregnant. <laughs> Thanks, Thanks, CNN. CNN. Breaking. Oh, and Kesha just took the dollar sign out of her name. Hmm. Sweet little Sarah. Is she beautiful? Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Look at those pudgy cheeks. She's a good little eater. I love her roly-poly arms. Would you look at her little tubby tummy? Okay, let's put the baby away. Do you have a fat baby? Are you ashamed of it? Everyone loves babies, but sometimes there's just too much to love. That's why you need Baby Spanx. The super elastic shapewear that smooths out all of your baby's unsightly bumps and bulges. In no time, your baby will go from flab to fab. Now that's a tight baby. What do you think now? Oh, my God, I hate your baby. It's so thin. <laughs> that child looks hot. What's her secret? A juice fast? Good genes, I guess. <laughs> I would never spank a baby, but I sure as hell would spanks one with baby spanks. <laughs> and be sure to try tabby spanks. Spanks for cats. The first months of a child's life are a special time. As your baby acquires the skills of social interaction, impressions are made that will last a lifetime. Unfortunately, this baby and millions of other male babies just like him spend months suffering through the shame and disgrace associated with male infantile baldness. It's a scientific fact that males lag developmentally behind females. Add male infantile baldness, and that means low self-esteem, decreased confidence, and even lowered social status. Is that what you want for your child? That's why our scientists at Nelson Pediatrics developed these baby toupees. <laughs> Thanks to our patented technology and the cooperation of the Chinese government, we can now take an adult-sized toupee and adapt it to fit your baby's head. It's fake hair with real results. Look at this child, <laughs> bursting with self-esteem, oozing with confidence. Now look at him two weeks ago. He's like a brand new person. And the best part is, you can't even tell it's fake. And look at Mr. Popular. Now he's king of the play date. He looks good, and he knows it. Isn't that what every parent wants? I should know. I'm not only the president of Nelson's Baby Toupees, I'm also the father of a client. Nelson's Baby Toupees, from the good people who brought you baby beards. You gave him life. Now give him confidence.
The holidays are here, so head to Macy's for unbeatable deals on a winter wardrobe for the whole family. Men's blazers starting at $49.99, cashmere tops for her from $79.99. And for your little ones, Macy's has the festive fashions that'll have them saying, It's too fun! It's <laughs> Tis the season for wrestling your wiggly little monster into thick winter clothes. So all month long, we're taking 25% off boys' merino wool sweaters that won't fit over his head. If you stop squirming, it would be on already. And 40% off cozy corduroys that'll pinch his little nuts. <laughs> Can't he just wear his jeans? You don't wear jeans to church. And for your little girl, it's half off all hard, shiny shoes that hurt. Oh, shoes hurt. Welcome to being a woman, Kylie. And 30% off all holiday rompers. She'll never get off in time. It's wet! Okay, well, you have to tell Mommy when you have to go. <laughs> the weather outside may be frightful, but in Macy's, we've got kids' jackets so big and thick, they won't fit in their car seat anymore. You didn't hear that, buddy. And save an extra 10% on snow boots that are so hard to put on, it'll strain your marriage. Sorry. sorry. You need to put her foot in sideways and twist it. Well, if you can do it, then do it. And deal so hot, even Frosty the... You need to learn, Nathan. Daddy's a dumbass. And deal so hot... OK, well, if this is going to be your attitude, maybe we should tell my mom we're not coming. And deal so... Oh, no! And miss your brother getting drunk and asking to borrow money? Whatever will I do? And for your new arrivals, we've got precious winter onesies with so many tiny buttons and snaps, you'll let your baby sit in a loaded diaper for hours just to avoid having to put it back on. Plus, everyday savings on mittens they'll lose, shirts with the wrong frozen princess, sweaters that make them hot, flannels that make them hot, scarves that make them hot. Good. Where's my kid? Marcus? And button downs with sharp, scratchy tacks in the back that'll have them bitching all season long. Look, we know it's awful for them and for you, but one day they'll be too old to wear cute little clothes like this and you'll miss it. So suck it up and get down to Macy's. The clothes they'll hate create the memories you'll love. <laughs> Levi, these are mommy's coworkers. Can you say hi? What's up, buddy? You looking fresh? <laughs> hey, you look nice. All right, give me a high five, buddy. Oh! Too strong. I bet you play football, right? Yeah, and you go to school. That sucks. Um, do you wear your clothes to school? Do you have no idea how to talk to children? Mm -hmm. Does it make you feel like a bad person that you can't? Mm -hmm. It's never too late to learn with new Duolingo for Talking to Children, the first foreign language app for grown people who need to learn how to talk to kids because their friends are starting to have them. Practice just five minutes a day, and you'll be a brat whisperer in no time. Very cool, bud. Very cool, bud. Chicken fingers. Chicken fingers. I like your backpack. The one thing you know about talking to kids is you're not allowed to call girls pretty, but then it's like, what do you say? You look not pretty. I mean, you're smart. I mean, you're an engineer one day. Are you OK? I got this. Just one second, sorry. Um, cool backpack. Get a better sense of kids' ages. Identify the 12-year-old. Correct. Practice traditional greetings. I've got your nose. Build your stamina for long, meandering, pointless stories. Yeah, I really like the pizza they have, too. Uh. Cool! In as little as six weeks, you'll be ready for all kinds of kinder conversations, like friend's new baby, the bus, dance recital, child falls on sidewalk in front of you, public restroom, airport gate, hot tub at vacation resort, and child wearing big pink dress. Let's face it, kids are bad conversationalists, but you don't have to be. So I bet you like chicken fingers. Hey! High five! Too slow! Duolingo for talking to kids. Also available in Your Dad.